যে কবিতা শুনতে জানে না সে ঝড়ের আর্ত নাচ শুনবে যে কবিতা শুনতে জানে না সে দিগন্তের অধিকার থেকে বঞ্চিত হবে যে কবিতা শুনতে জানে না সে আ জন্মকৃত দাস থেকে যাবে আমি উচ্চারিত সত্যের মতো স্বপ্নের কথা বলছি উনুনের আগুনে আলোকিত এক উজ্জ্বল জানালার কথা বলছি আমি আমার মায়ের কথা বলছি তিনি বলতেন প্রবহমান নদী যে সাতার জানে না তাকে ভাসিয়ে রাখে যে কবিতা শুনতে জানে না সে নদীতে ভাসতে পারে না যে কবিতা শুনতে জানে না সে মাছের সঙ্গে খেলা করতে পারে না যে কবিতা শুনতে জানে না সে মায়ের কোলে শুয়ে গল্প শুনতে পারে না আমি কিংবদন্তির কথা বলছি আমি আমার পূর্বপুরুষের কথা বলছি আমি বিচলিত স্নেহের কথা বলছি গর্ভবতী বোনের মৃত্যুর কথা বলছি আমি আমার ভালোবাসার কথা বলছি থ্যাংক ইউ ভেরি মাচ for your strong poem. Now we have another performance by Chomuk Hassan. This soothing song is a deep devotion to the presence of Bangla in every aspect of our life. Please welcome Chomuk Hassan.
আমি যা কিছু মহান বরণ করেছি বিনম্র সাগরের জল বাংলায় আমার তৃষ্ণার জল তৃপ্ত শেষ আমি একবার দেখি বারবার দেখি দেখি বাংলার Thank you, Chomok. Ladies and gentlemen, with this performance, our cultural function has come to an end. Now, I would like to hand over the stage to our today's host, Mr. Sabi Uddin Omur, Cultural Secretary, Bangladesh Student Association, to conclude the program with his Thanksgiving speech. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Sabi Uddin Omur. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, hope you have enjoyed the program, haven't you? Well, uh, this Bangladesh Student Association has been around for three years now. Uh, we have always been a very close group of people, always buzzing with activities. And uh, particularly, the year 2011 has been very eventful for us. So tonight, we will take a look back at the year 2011. Uh, the year started off with uh, uh, an Akushi program just uh, like this one, but that was hosted by the Bangladeshi community in South Carolina. They have been doing it for a long time, and uh, it's been always a very uh, enjoyable experience being part of that. Uh, we also synced up with the uh, local international community by participating in the Columbia International Fair uh, uh, in April. And on the 14th of April, uh, we actually celebrated uh, the Bangla New Year, it was uh, 1418. Uh, uh, we had a very uh, nice party. Uh, uh, it was a lot of fun. In June, we had our general election, and uh, we got ourselves a, a, a new uh, administrative committee. Uh, then we had our Fraser's reception. Every year, we have hosts of Bangladeshi students coming into USA. And uh, BSA has always uh, lent them a hand uh, to be settled and stuff like that. Uh, so last year we were very happy to welcome uh, 10 new graduate students. Uh, on the other hand, uh, uh, we also saw uh, uh, several of our old students graduating uh, and leaving us. Uh, uh, they will always be uh, in our uh, mind. BSA members have always been eager participants in the sports activities on the campus. And actually in October we came up with our own tournament. Uh, it was called Interstudent. Uh, Friendship Football League, uh, five nations uh, participated in that, uh, uh, people from different, uh, five different countries, and it was a huge success. So we are planning to uh, uh, organize that event uh, again this year, maybe uh, on a bigger scale and with a fancier name like uh, BSA World Challenge or something like that. So uh, we can't wait for that. Uh, then it was a pleasant experience for our cultural team to participate in the annual cultural event of Indian Student Organization, Jashan. Uh, uh, and uh, you've seen that uh, Indian students also participated in our event tonight. So I hope uh, uh, this collaboration will continue in future. And we always look forward to collaboration with other student organizations uh, uh, on the campus too. And uh, toward the end of the year, uh, we participated in the International Bazaar which was an event uh, of uh, the International Ed Education Week. And we also had a small uh, meet and greet session uh, on that occasion. Apart from this, BSA has always arranged uh, numerous get-together events and pleasure tri trips uh, for the members throughout the year. We had picnics, we had uh, barbecues, parties, campouts, and all sorts of fun. Uh, in all, it was uh, quite some year for us. Now, ladies and gentlemen, we are 
almost at the end of the program. Uh, thank you all for coming out here, uh, joining us and celebrating uh, the International Mother Language Day. It has always been a great day for us, and uh, uh, actually your participation has made it particularly special for us, uh, the Bangladeshi students in South Carolina. I'd uh, like to specifically thank our chief guest, uh, uh, I guess he's not here right now, right, he left, uh, Dr. Uh, Timothy Dupnik uh, for taking out time uh, from his busy schedule, uh, and we are pre really appreciate his presence. And we're also very honored to have uh, 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 many uh, uh, USC faculties amongst us. Uh, I mean, uh, we really appreciate your presence. And I would also like to thank the international performers who actually made this event uh, truly international. Uh, actually, uh, uh, mm, uh, we are, uh, I mean, we deeply appreciate your participation in spite of the very short notice. Uh, without your contribution, this program uh, would not be possible. Uh, so a big round of applause for our international <laughs> performers. And I would like to take the opportunity uh, to uh, uh, express our heartfelt gratitude to the Bangladeshi community in South Carolina they have always uh, been uh, with us in all of our good times and bad times. And uh, actually, 8,000 miles away from home, you have given us a family. So uh, we will always appreciate that no matter where we go from here, we, you will always be in our heart. So uh, a big round of applause for them, too. <laughs> well, last but of course not least, uh, I would like to thank the BSA family for being such a nice community. And uh, it's your dedication and sacrifice that uh, has made this sort of programs possible uh, here. And uh, I would like to specifically thank Ishtia Krov uh, for uh, taking up the monumental task of uh, coordinating the program and presenting us uh, with such a cute souvenir. Uh, uh, give them a big hand, please. And also, special thanks goes to uh, Totini Bhavi and her group uh, for the beautiful stage design and actually the show here. Actually, this is a very important symbol of that, this event, uh, uh, this show here, the monument. Uh, also, don't forget to say thanks uh, to the people behind the food trays, uh, people who cook the foods, uh, uh, very uh, delicious foods, and so often, I think they deserve a big hand. And thank you all again for uh, uh, joining us in the celebration. Uh, it was so great being with you, and hope uh, we will see you in the coming years, too. So until then, uh, stay safe and healthy. Have a good night.